Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you've been following along with me on my channel for a while, you know that I've been doing the Eat Like a Gilmore cookbook and I've been reviewing it recipe by recipe. And today we're going to do the chai tea latte. This is listed under town favorites. So in the cookbook, they're relating the chai tea latte to Chris, who is Rory's father, because when he was in Stars Hollow, he asked Luke for a chai tea latte. So the interesting part of this for me is because every Thai tea I've ever had just came in a tea bag. It was already mixed with all the spices and I just had to boil it and drink it. But this has a list of seasonings and some pretty good step-by-step -step instructions on how to make a delicious chai tea latte. So there's a, like I said, there's a long list of spices. I already measured them out because I didn't want to waste time on that. There's cinnamon, cardamom, stars anise, fresh ginger, allspice, nutmeg, black peppercorn, and cloves. So I already have the water measured in the pot and I'm ready to make tea with you. Let's begin. Okay, so we're beginning with heating up the water. There's three cups of water. And I'm going to add all the spices into it right away. Drink every last one. And we just need to wait for that to have a rolling boil. And then we're going to add the honey and stir that until it's fully dissolved once it's boiling. It says to stir the pot every 30 seconds or so. You can see the stars and anise floating on top. I love that color. It shouldn't be long for it to become a boil. It smells delicious. It smells so good. Okay, it's already starting to boil. Get honey bear here and we'll put three tablespoons of honey. sticky. It's point though, isn't it? Two. And three. Stir until fully dissolved. Should not take long. Okay, it dissolved pretty quickly. It says to remove from heat and add in your tea bags and let them seep for four minutes. It's just six black tea bags. While that is seeping for four minutes, we have to work on the milk. Okay, we just pour a cup and a half of whole milk into a container. Seal it up and shake it for one minute. Afterwards it says to microwave for a minute. This is supposed to make it frothy. And then of course the microwave will make it heat it up. Okay, let's assemble our latte. I need a strainer. And pour your cup about two-thirds full through the strainer. Lauren is in. That's perfect, actually. Perfect. 
and then fill the rest with your warm frothy whole milk oh that looks beautiful all right who's ready to try it with me okay here's my favorite part of every recipe oh that's really good I feel like it could be sweeter but I'm probably just used to the way Starbucks makes theirs or the way I make mine it tastes just like I expect chai tea to taste and the milk makes it so creamy I could have worked on making the milk a little more frothy to make it the latte part but I really like this and I definitely will be finishing it because I think it's like a comforting drink so um, don't forget to subscribe because I have more of these recipes coming out and I have a lot of other videos for you coming up soon. I hope you all have a great day. Bye!